Hello Sagittarius, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Please remember this is a general reading. It won't resonate with everyone. You can look at your moon and rising signs for greater clarity. You deserve love. You are lovable, with a big exclamation mark. You definitely are. You're lovable, you're, you're capable and deserve love here. So let's see what this is about. You're a unique human being. And we all are lovable and deserve love in our lives. I'll take three cards for you, three cards for the person, and three cards for the outcome. The King of Cups, the World card, and the Six of Cups. Now you are looking good. You are feeling good. You, you're somebody who's mature and happy, emotionally stable. You're somebody who's enjoying life. There's a playfulness. There could be people, fond memories from your past. You could have had a lovely childhood. There's reminiscing here about past events. There could be past people that you've fond memories of coming into your life or somebody from a past life coming in. And there's a brand new chapter ready to start for you. Now, this could be a new love that's coming in because you deserve love. Because you're in a high vibrational energy and you're feeling good about life and there's a playfulness around you, you can attract somebody into your life who is a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio energy or somebody with that in their chart. And they are emotionally mature. So this could be somebody, for example, that you knew when you were younger, from childhood, or somebody that was a bit immature. And when they're coming back to you, they're coming back emotionally mature now. Now, this person here is caring and loving. They're genuine. They might not wear their heart on their sleeve, but they definitely feel emotion. They might not always show it. And this person is coming back here or coming into your life and it's going to start a brand new chapter for you because you deserve to be loved. You're good. This can be you. This is you in a very good place. You're enjoying life. You're happy. Let's see here what this person, if you're not and you, you, you want to bring love into your life, it's about enjoying life. You enjoying uh, life and that's what brings in because that's high vibrational, that will attract in the right people. But I definitely think there's somebody genuine coming in here. Um, let's see what this person is about, because you're looking good. The Four of Pentacles, the Three of Wands, and the Ace of Cups, definitely. So this person has might be single for a while. They might have, you know, built up something good for themselves because they're emotionally mature. They've, they've established a certain amount of security in their life, but there's something missing. They're feeling stuck and they're wanting love. They're wanting to be happy in every area of their life. So it can be that they're making plans for their future. They're planning and manifesting you to come into their life and they're prepared to take a risk and ha uh, at love and romance again. So this is somebody who's looking for love, it could be attracted to you. The universe is bringing the two of you together here because they're, although they've established a lot in their life, there's something missing and they feel it's romance. And it's somebody that you could plan a future with. There's somebody who they've built this, this type of security in their life because they've been creative. They've been hardworking. They've, um, they've been prepared to make plans and go forward and work on things. So they're a very good person. Like I say here, there's somebody who's matured a lot in life uh, and they're going to come forward towards you. So let's see what the outcome of this is going to be. The Nine of Wands, the Four of Wands and the Six of Swords. Now, you've been through challenges. You've learned loads of lessons, the two of you. I feel you're both on the same vibrational level here. I think you're liking life. I think you've established yourselves, the two of you have established yourselves very well in certain areas of your life, but you've had a lot to learn about love. I think the two of you have had very similar experiences in the past when it comes to relationships, but you've learned a lot and you've gained a lot of clarity and you've learned how to move on. And this is things, you know, coming together, you're going to, Move yourself on here. Both of you are going to move on and things will become clearer as you go forward. You'll learn more about each other here and we'll get over all the teething problems here. And it could be a very fruitful relationship that comes forward. 
It could lead to marriage, it could lead to family, it could be living together, whatever it is. But this is a relationship that through time, you will get over the initial humps of things and you'll learn about each other. And from, between that and what you've learned in your past, you're going to move from choppy waters and you'll start to see the relationship grow as time progresses. And this could be very fruitful and it could be very successful for those that are wanting family. Not everybody does, but it's going to be a very successful, stable outcome because the two of you have learned from past experiences. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.